having the last bit of time there. The Hellstorm getting three, though, including one of his teammates. That's not the ideal situation. It's still walking down an important play of the ramp. He finds three. He's still got a grab slam to use. Not going to need it here, though, as he clears out everything by these gun placements. Piper trying to make... Absolutely nutty. Scrape the blood down those walls, man. That was... Jeez, he's awakening. See it one more time. Wow. From the window to the wall. 12 HP for this player. Able to walk back through and being able to hold down that window. Really, really well played. Even, like... The sheer, the sheer brass. <laughs> let's, let's, let's let Will it have his moment because this is the double beat down into like three more afterwards. I'm pretty sure. Actually, you want to no, talk about the RK7? I will want to talk about the RK7. I absolutely will. And I'm going to get flamed because Landon is now a world championship caliber player. And I am lost by all of the decisions that were just made by both ICR players coming forward. This is Willet on the shutdown for the War Machine. I believe that is actually the double beatdown, just not able to find all of it. Right now. Ruby, goodness me, uh, looking really tight, really around all those heads up gunfights. We'll see another big play from him here. As this was, again, one of those hits from the front that where's the presence here for Claw? Uh, I don't know how Groovy's allowed to stay alive right there. I mean, flat out, that's not a fight that he should win. He's able to turn it into, I believe, four here. He, no, just three, just kidding. Uh, but big moments. Just kidding, there's the fourth. That could have sworn I saw a fourth. At one point in time, Willet is also in the conversation. So this is a big moment for Vanity. It's even bigger for Carnage if they can find the shutdown. There's the lightning strike in the Hellstorm for Reaper seven straight, and he's getting very close to his, his opening Tempest. Uh, absolutely huge. Also, this Graf Slam on this side with Yonko Willow getting very close as well, but it looks like he doesn't really need it right now. Just being able to take <laughs> members of Carnage. After that one, a couple of really unfortunate team kills really kind of stopped that comeback from really ever getting off the ground. We can just see one play from Charles here out of so many that this player was able to find. It's off the initial opening of this map. And Insane. Cheese Louise, man. Like, that's honestly some of the best play that I've seen, especially just say opportunity coming through concussion mm. is used charles only able to find one on the back side he's got no time to play with and both players are stacked here oh. opportunity maybe 1v1 charles. charles he's got the time as well what a clutch five straight for charles and he'll get the lightning strike charles what the heck man i impressive to say the least being able to oh, turn yeah. that back around and well, take, taking the pressure originally that after uh, being hit through the front, realizing that they couldn't end up joining through the front as well, like you said, just uh, in and out of the window, you get to see it. And their POV one more time, just being able to get the one and then being able to get the snap down immediately, the sim shot coming through. Really good shots over there. And like you really said, time. Shot. If there were to be comeback potential, it'd have to be off of these specialists alone. Dilo doesn't find much value, but the zoning is great. Will it able to find two? That's going to be enough for him to get a grab slam. So now just like this, 200 for Vanity. If they can full hold, which it looks like they're just about to, if they can find Demonic, which they do, it's going to be about a 10 to 15 point game. It just comes down to this last hilt from Green Higgs. They need to break it. Grab oh slam Oh my three. god. Lightning strike is there. The full wipe is about to come through, and Vanity are going to be ahead of the rotation for Cafe. The comeback is very much so alive. Yeah, they are going to be able to set this one back. Gonna be sending a couple members up here to the cafe as well, looking to finalize this on P4. Lightning Strike comes through and it finds one. It's a zoning tool more than anything. Zinku gets shut down as well. And now the hard point of being in full control of Vanity, they are looking to make this a very close game and it's going to be just that trace coming through. Back in the pinstripe is the kill feed. However, Vanity is getting dealt with Demonic up here in the stairwell from Cafe is They're actually finding a lot out. of value. But I was about to say, look how far the spawns are coming from Green Eggs. And they're coming in staggered fashion. You have to wait for a small second. You have to hit one more time together because there's no way you break this individually. 248, 249, Vanity, are you kidding me? The three hill comeback is absolutely alive and well. Big place. Driveway side fences by that well before they make a committal. And it's actually keeping DTO a little bit on their toes, not quite locking down either side as they're actually pulling a five man split as well across the map. Look how they really had Robbie moving back and forwards so they can figure out what was going on. Nice shot onto Tish. Gonna start what? off. And the no! This is crap. What is this man doing? Oh, buddy. Someone's been putting in the bolt action. Uh, TDM only game mode. One. Are you kidding me? 
grab off him could be huge. He's making the play, trying to work his way around. He's got to commit to it. Hyper, get in there and hit the triggers. There it is. Oh, Five minute slam for Hyper. The full wipe, and that's the grab slam worth remembering. Oh my god, that is going to allow them to hold.